Mother's Day. As you can see, we're having one already. We're getting a party started. Yeah, we've early. come we've come far. We haven't come that far. Mom, we're still back here, huh? It's yeah, so funny how that works out. You guys right. got the money seats. Huh? We, have, we have the athletes in the back. You should have had a girl. How's the lighting? Is the lighting good on my mom back here? She yes. deserves better than this. Also, Julia Sweeney has adopted me, so that happened during the commercial. Right? I know. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. so you guys, Mother's Day is Sunday, and the staff, they have obviously all surprises with you guys. So this is uncharted territory for all of us, and they're joining us for a jam session, as you can see. So Hi. let's do it. You ready? All right, let's jump into it. I'm still going to leave the charge from back here, all the way back here. All right, let's do it. Catherine Hahn was one of the stars of the Bad Moms movie, which was hysterical, and she's telling mothers, just take a step back for a minute. In a recent interview, she gave this piece of advice. You can have it all, but it won't look the way you thought it would look. I have a job that's fulfilling. I have a chaotic household. You have to let go of the idea of perfection. You have to remind yourself that you can do it all, but you might not have to. Mothers, you have the floor. What do you guys think about Ms. Hans' take here? I think she's absolutely right on. But you did do it all, Mom. Uh, not perfectly, remember? <laughs> <laughs> Here's my, really quick, the one is thing that I... Is this the peanut butter? It's okay, you did the best you could. I did. I know it's a lie. One yeah. thing I always I remember you. about my mom was, you know, she was a working mom, so was my father, but my mom still did everything for us. Mm -hmm. And there's always those days we wouldn't have to pack lunch on our way to school in the morning, so she'd be like, don't worry about it, I'll bring up some fast food at lunch. Right. Recess, I'll meet you. Recess would come, me and my brothers would come up, wait by the gate. My mom maybe 50% of the time wouldn't show up. That's and we'd true. borrow food from somebody else. That's not true. So that's maybe the only thing you didn't do right. That's right, Julia, it's true. Can, can I say talks about you all the time, like how you're a, a working mom and like you are a CEO a of a boss. company. He She's talks about you all the time oh, and how you sweet. do it all. That's and sweet. all of our moms up here are working moms. Yeah. Like, how did you guys balance it? We did the best we could. <laughs> I know I did the best yeah, I and could. And my, my father actually passed when I was 11, and so yeah. you became an unexpected single mom. Yes. And I feel like I had a really good childhood before my father passed oh, and after. Yeah. You did a good job. I tried. Oh. I tried hard. Oh. Oh. Mom, what did you feel like was the hardest part of balancing work and home and everything else? I think sometimes being a good wife. Oh, oh yeah. yeah. I think that, that becomes last. That was, yeah. <laughs> I think he got the short end of the stick, I think. Because really. you really, you know, you want to be foremost. You want to be a good mom and yeah. then good at your work because people yeah. are depending on you mm -hmm. and clients are, you know, yeah. depending on you doing your, yeah. your job. And then I think, you know, you want to be a good family person for my mom, my grandmother, you know, his mom. You know, the whole, we, we hold the whole Just family together. Yes. Yeah. We're yeah. like the son, I always say. Mm -hmm. We hold the whole family together. Mm -hmm. And yeah. I think that maybe, Poor Jimmy got it. <laughs> so true. Julie, the short Julie, end of the stick. Yeah. <laughs> Julie, I got to ask you because you were in Hollywood and made the huge sacrifice to say, I want to get away from this world so I can uh, maybe parent properly, for lack of a better word, there. And you kind of got Well, I think, like, when I was working, I was working so much, I was barely there. Like, and also, I had to hire a nanny and pay for a bunch of people, so I had to earn a lot of money. And it was like this <laughs> feedback loop where I had to keep working to keep the staff going. And then yeah. I was like, hardly could ever see my kid. Yeah. Right. Then I went completely the other way where I married Michael and I was able to really be at home he could be the breadwinner as I say I got to be the bread eater <laughs> and I love bread I have no problem eating bread um, and so but you know it's a first of all it's a big job but there's also that's hard too because you're kind of taken for granted and you come you you know you're serving everyone else there were many days where I felt like you know I used to be somebody. Yeah. Now I'm just, all, all I'm saying to people is like, can I get you anything more with that? <laughs> you know, and, <laughs> um, and that's hard in itself, sure. yeah. you know. In a yeah. minute, well, can we do this really quick? What's the most rewarding thing going across the room as a mother? What's the most rewarding thing? Seeing your kid grow up and become a person, just like Aww. in the world, that functioning independently, that's the greatest. Mama D? Sharing the journey with your children, just watching them grow, and it's just the best 20 years of your life. You copied Julia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I know that you said it much better than no, me. No, that was good. Oh, Mama P. Well, it was the best thing I ever could have done. I love both of my children. And I always get teased, which one do you love the most? I, we are, you don't so have I, to say it. Okay. Okay. <laughs> my best daughter and my best son. Uh. <laughs> okay, Mom, I always go long on a show, so you cannot go long. All right, you gotta be quick. I won't. You're an amazing young man, and I'm proud of you. Oh! Aww. How many grandchildren do you want from Jordan? <laughs> she got one already. Two. You want two more? Yeah. Three's a good number. I three's got three. Three's Sounds a good like number. I got some work to do, number. Shay, when I get home. There we go. Oh, Lord. Let's uh -huh. wrap the show. <laughs>